Can you imagine a world where everybody is similar, same shape, same beliefs, same gender? We can't either. We all differ from each other. We came from different ethicalities, we have different skin color, we all differ age, different heights, different weights. We do have different beliefs, political views, skill and backgrounds, economic status, experiences or sexual orientation or gender identity. Not even speaking of details like eye color. All of those, the differences, they make every one of us unique and the mixture of uniqueness is diversity. We bring all of our qualities and create diverse communities. However, diverse community is just the first step. If you bring all of the greatest minds in the world together and don't let them speak, you are not going anywhere. And the same is with diversity. To really benefit from it, you need inclusion. In other words, you need an environment which enables all of those different people to speak up, be heard and, crucially, be listened to. That enables us to understand other approaches and way of seeing. We can learn from others, get to know other cultures, religions and so on and be less prejudiced against alternative. So when more and more of us learn this, we all create more open society. Inclusion gives us an opportunity to see problems from different perspectives and enables us to be more. So, to sum up, diversity may be interpreted as a fact of people being different. Inclusion, on the other hand, is more about actions we make to make everyone full member of team or society.